So guys, it seems like our girl Spice is going through suffering and complications from a surgery that she and this had. Is all alleged. And this is from Gossip of the City T, who's always been correct and first on most of the tea. It says, ladies, I'm receiving reports that Spice was in the Dominican Republic and having some work done and is suffering from complications, crying face emoji. I'm very saddened by this news and will keep everyone updated as the story is developing. Nothing is confirmed. And it continues, ladies, so far we know she went into surgery and made it back to the recovery house. Trying to confirm further information, but she's definitely in Dominican Republic and definitely got surgery. That much has been confirmed. Happy healing to her praying hands. And I hope she continues to recover because I know it's a lot of pressure on most women, especially if they're in the entertainment business, to have that certain look, that certain figure, that certain eye-catching look. But they're also risking things that comes with any surgery, even when you're having surgery to help your health. And correct things. It comes with complications and things. And so when you're doing cosmetic surgery, also to better yourself as far as your looks and things, you still have those same type of complications as you would have with any surgery. And sadly, there have been a lot of stories of women who got on that table and didn't make it all. And you know, we've seen a lot of before and after pics of people and artists and things who look real thin before they got the surgery done to their bodies. And it's a lot of pressure on a lot of people to look a certain way with these things being flashed in the media as this is the go-to look and this is how such and such people need to look if they're going to be like this and catch this type of person because the look has become such a norm so much i remember when glorilla was first coming out and things and people was looking at her saying she needed to get a bbl when the girl was just being her natural self allegedly and i'm not just making these things up because according to the national nope. center for health research cosmetic surgeons estimate that the invasive procedure and anesthesia involved in their procedures result in a death rate of 1 in 1,000 outpatient procedures. This translates to approximately 100 cosmetic surgery related deaths per year. Just think about how popular BBLs have gotten even though it seems to should have played out by now but it's not. There are still people going to get them, and that means so many people on the surgery table per year. These people stay getting paid. And when I say people, I say these surgeons and hospitals. So you know when people saw this, they had to put their two cents in, and they had to comment. So someone said, yes, I'm in this surgery group, and Spice allegedly is having complications due to her surgery in the Dominican Republic. So I comment, and someone goes... Are you talking about Ice Spice, girl, if you don't get it? They saying Dance Hall Queen Spice is fighting for her life after a bad surgery job. Hashtag love hip hop ATL. So Spice and the DR having complications due to surgery. Oh no, just need to love oneself a little bit more. Get at her gym. What? So someone said prayers to her, no time for surgery talk versus natural body. OMG, please stay off the table once cool, but two, three, and four times is unacceptable. Work hard to maintain. The links women go to to look perfect baffles me. I've never understood the reasoning behind, yeah. but I hope she heals because it's horrible to go through, I'm sure. I'm Dominican and I love my country, but I would never get work done out there. Prayers for her. Someone else says, stop leaving the country to get surgery. Surgery has nothing to do with loving yourself. The results that the DR surgeons provide, the gym cannot, so y'all stop saying that too. Wishing her a speedy recovery. Also, for the surgery naysayers, the DR surgeons take out an unhealthy amount of body fat. That's why people are always passing away. The U.S. doctors don't play no that. No judgment for those who seeking surgery, but stay in the States if you're certain age, weight, or have minor health issues. Not saying Spice does, but DR doctors don't have the type of health limitations like the U.S. A lot of them go over because the U.S. doctors didn't approve them. It's not about being rich. A lot of the times they go to whatever doctor that will agree to do what they want. Praying for Spice. I know she have enough money to afford going to an American doctor. I don't knock anyone that wants to fix their problem areas. But dang, spend the extra money so you make it out alive. Praying for her. Well, yeah, there you have it, folks. Some people are talking a lot of sense. And some are making some good points. The VR doctors don't 
do all the requirements and things that the U.S. require. And a lot of the times they will deny you, especially if this is your second, third, and fourth time getting this stuff done. I mean, in the United States, they do have a limitation on certain things. And I know you want your body to look right, but the DR don't, they don't really care. As long as you bring that money, they sometimes don't care if you live or die. You would just be another statistic. And for some reason, that seems to be the go-to for a lot of celebrities and things to go get surgery done, the ones who've had it multiple times because because I've heard of different people saying that they almost died going to the DR. So I think people should take a second look or a think again about where they go to get this cosmetic surgery done. Because if I'm not mistaken, I know Hazel E, she had a bad recovery. But I think she went to Turkey and had her surgery done and it was botched. And she almost lost her life. She got an infection and had to they had to take her breast out. So... Yeah, she lost her breast behind it. So I think the United States would be one of the best places to stay in to have surgery, in my opinion. But hey, people gonna do what they gonna do. Yeah. So guys, tell me what you think about this entire situation down in the comments below. Subscribe to the channel for more updates. Give me a thumbs up, share if you care. And I'll talk to you guys later.